Islands boys soccer had one of the best seasons in program history a year ago, but fell in the first round of the state playoffs. The roster had seven seniors, and just a year later, the Sharks only have three. Regardless of that turnover, the youth of this year's team has turned out to be a positive, and that's rarely the case in high school sports. Young players usually correlate with growing pains, but in the grand scheme of the Sharks' 2024 season, it's played a very positive role. As head coach Justin Brantley told us yesterday, almost half of his starting lineup in the first game of the season were freshmen. It's led to the group growing up together. Going into the season, we knew we were young. Uh, we knew we had a, a young team. Um, we didn't realize how young we were. Uh, and then, you know, our first game, we realized that, hey, we're starting four freshmen today. Um, so it was really, really eye-opening. You know, we found out early on in the season that uh, it's not always the, the best 11 players are, are playing. It's always the best 11 that can work well together, um, kind of makes a team. So uh, that's been our goal this season is to try to figure out what our best 11 is, to try to figure out, you know, what is the best version of ourselves. Mm -hmm. The Sharks have figured out a great version of themselves since opening the season two and three. They've won seven of their last nine games. It's because of their ability to continuously adapt. During the game, it's really like, let's implement what we want to see in future games. And then after you kind of want to, you want to be like, you know, this is seven and oh, but our next game might not be like this. So we really have to keep up the intensity and we can't let this affect uh, the level that we're going to play at. We've been playing these good teams, so we, we see how we need to play when we do play, like these region matchups. We need to be fast. And then in practice, I feel like we've really picked up the intensity and uh, our dedication to the game. The final three games of the regular season will really show how far the Sharks have swam. South Effingham, Benedictine, and West Lawrence have a combined record of 29-9-2. Well, it's opening day around Major League Baseball.